But the big thing, of, as I've said over and over and over, to me, is the change of attitude that we've got. And that's what horse training is all about, to get this attitude, get this way of thinking. When you've got this attitude with your horse, everything else becomes so easy. Now, again, it doesn't matter we've taken four days with him, it might take four weeks with another one. It doesn't matter. Until you get it, you've got nothing. And you can have this for the rest of his life, and you can build on this, and, and, and instead of him resisting and fighting and, and thinking, how can I get out of this, he starts, his mind's changed now to thinking, what does he want me to do? Where does he want me to walk? How does he want me to walk there? How does he want me to bend? So his whole focus has changed from what's going on out there or what's going on here or what's going on somewhere else. His whole focus has come on to me. And people talk about teaching a horse to give. He's giving his mind to me now. That's what giving to me means. He's giving his mind. It doesn't mean he dropped his head or he pulled his head around here or something else. He's, he's giving his mind to me. And until the horse gives you, gives you his mind, you've got nothing. So it's not about softening up his neck or softening up his leg or anything else. If you want to call it, call it anything, you can call it softening up his mind. Again, he hasn't been frightened. He's not expecting to be frightened. <coughs> 